not easy being me We'll wash your face and brush your hair We'll nag, 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 it's just not fair I'm Horrid Henry So tell me school, I'm gonna rule And when I'm king, I'll do my thing And then my life will be so sweet I'm Horrid Henry Na, 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 na The purple hand gang rules, okay so easy being me, I'm Horrid Henry. What's wrong now, Henry? Well, Moody Margaret got the new Gross Class Zero game. I want one. But you've got lots of other computer games, Henry. But I need that game! Oh, I'm fed up of living next door to Moody Margaret. Well... You might not be living next door to her for much longer. What do you mean, Worm? Dad's got a new job, so we're moving house. Moving house? Yes! No more Moody Margaret! Of course, if we move, there are a few conditions. Oh, yes. One, the new house must be nearer to Ralph's house. Right. And it must not have any girls living next door. Well, the new house will definitely be further away. Hooray! Because Dad's new job is in another part of the country. Another part of the country? Oh, everyone I know is here. If I move, the only boy I'll know is Peter. No! Will you please get out of bed, Henry? What? Good morning, Mum. You're up? Yes. And dressed? Yes. Are you feeling all right, Henry? It's a school day. I don't want to be late. Sorry. I love my school. You do? Oh, yeah. So many things to learn. Bye-bye. He must be coming down with something. Hello, Margaret. <laughs> what are you doing? Creeping up on people like that? I, uh, I just wondered if I could play with you. What? No, because it's so good having a really good friend to play with right next door. Have you gone mad? Last time I saw you, you called me a mouldy old measle. <laughs> no, I didn't. Shh. Then you said I don't know what I'd do if I could never see you again, Margaret. I can't tell you how much you mean to me, Margaret. <gasps> don't you ever do that again. Now, get out of here. With pleasure. And just so you know, you are a mouldy old measle. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. No time for that. Get everyone together. Right. Come to my house this afternoon. Right. And get everyone to say how much they'd miss me if I wasn't here. Uh, but you are here. Well, I am now, but I might not be soon. Oh, right. I'll pay them to say it in fuzzy gumballs. Oh, right. Well, get on with it then. Right. Is there anything to eat? Mum's back. This is it. Oh, hello, everyone. Uh, yes, well, I mean, we just wanted to say... <laughs> what he means is, we're all going to miss Henry when he moves. He's such a good friend. He's very... wise. Really? Do you feel the same way, Bert? Uh, I don't know. Yes, he does. Um, we'll all really, really miss Henry. Hmm. Well, I'm really sorry to hear that. Yes! <laughs> but we are moving, so you'll all just have to get used to it, I'm afraid. Oh. Henry! Oh, what have I done now? 
nothing. I just wanted to say what a lovely day it is. You're moving away, I hear. Yes, I am. Yes, a really lovely day. Listen up. I've got some really bad news. Oh, you're not moving after all. No, I am moving. Yes! <laughs> and I'm saying off my things. So, what have I bid for this genuine school desk, as once used by the famous Henry? <laughs> Who'd want to buy your smelly desk? It's not even yours. So, do I hear ten pounds? Sit down, all of you. So, Henry. Uh, yes, Miss Battleaxe. You're leaving us. Yes, Miss Battleaxe. Go to your desk, Henry. Oh, right. <laughs> oh, everyone seems really happy to see me go. Dad and I have decided that we're going to have a big farewell party for the whole family. Woo! Goody! Can I make the invitations? Of course you can, Peter. How about you, Henry? Who are you going to invite? Nobody. A really nice thing happened at work today. It seems everyone's getting together to buy me a leaving present. Really? I want all my friends to come to the party. Gangway! Hello, Henry. I just wanted to say how much I'm going to miss you all, my friends. Oh? If only I had something to remember you all by. Like what? Oh, let me see. How about the new gross class hero game? Well, I suppose we could have a collection. Great! Oh, and there's a farewell party at my house on Saturday. That would be a good time to give me my leaving present. Out of my way, worm! This could be my leaving present. Welcome. Oh, it's you. Hmm. Very nice welcome, I'm sure. We want to make sure you're actually leaving. Oh, ha, ha. Welcome. Gross Class Zero! Oh, Miss Lovely. Miss Lovely, you came! Yes, and this is for you, Peter. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Lovely. <laughs> what a toady toad! <laughs> Hello, Henry Hatcher. Oh, no, this is going to be the worst party ever! Where's Ralph with my present? Oh, welcome to the party. <laughs> Where's Ralph with my present? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> so much for my so-called friends. Uh, <clears throat> I just wanted to thank you all for coming and on behalf of the whole family say how much we'll all miss you. Except me, I won't miss you. Don't be horrid, Henry. Here you are, Henry. We all club together. It's something to help you remember us all as you start your new life. Oh, thanks. Maybe I will miss some of you then. What is this? It's a snow globe. Look, it snows when you shake it. Is that it? Nothing else? No gross class zero game? Uh, no. Sorry, Henry. Oh, I hope my new friends are more generous than you lot. That's it, Henry. Go to your room. And no TV or pocket money or sweets ever again. Uh, hello, Henry. Thanks for coming, Ralph. I, uh, I wanted to say I, uh, well, you know, the other day... Yes, Henry? Uh, well, when I said what I said... Yes, Henry? Well, I'm... Gangway! Box of very special buddies coming through! Woohoo! I'm... You know what I mean, Ralph. Yeah, I do. Well, see you, Henry. 
Yeah, see you, Ralph. Just one last thing to do before I go. <laughs> Henry, we've got some good news. We're not moving! What? After all that? Mr Bob saw how many people came to the party and said he couldn't take us away from such good friends and neighbours. So, we're staying, Henry, just like you wanted. Are you happy now? Are you being horrid, Henry? Henry! <laughs>